favourites up in the air, Chris and me. The old boy, Barry Pert, a new master. For three generations of Joneses, and Master Lavros won it for Mark Jones. If Mary was here, you know what she would say. Here they go in the Woodlands free-for-all. Chris and me gallop coming into the turn the first time. Favourites up in the air, Chris and me. And Caribbean blaster squeezed past, cop to bump, but lost no ground. He's pacing again, Chris and me. This will be terror to Lovish if he can win from there. And suave Stewie Lombo leads by a head easy on the eye, really working the leader. Reined up three wide Caribbean blaster. Held up both sleepy trip and also fly like an eagle from Pembroke Benny. Suave Stewie Lombo grabbed by easy on the eye. Run coming. Coming now for Fly Like an Eagle, Pembroke Benny's out wide, easy on the eye, Pembroke Benny, Caribbean Blaster still there, Pembroke Benny, the old boy, Barry Pert, a new master, Pembroke Benny won it for Zach Butcher, and has beaten either easy on the eye, or Caribbean Blaster may be in that order. Chris and me's gone great after the run he had. Over the years of having horses in the cup and the, and the free for all, the, the horse that wins the cup or goes very good, usually always backs up and goes good in the free for all. And, and I just thought without trying to be too biased, I thought his run in the cup was probably the second best run in the race. He's been an unlucky horse in big races and uh, I'm just so thrilled for the horse that uh, he could uh, get this because um, you know, there's a number of races he may have won. I mean, I know racing, no, no one knows, but you know, he's gone certainly well and uh, it's, it's a great thrill to get him. Peak making ground wide out, but stick leads for home. Third quarter, 29 seconds. Master Lavros is going to go after him. Two links to stint, and then came Peak and Vulcan. It's Master Lavros on the inside of Stig. It's going to be the Dominion for three generation of Joneses. And Master Lavros won it for Mark Jones and beat Stig and Stint. Yeah, it's a big relief, and um, it's a race I've always wanted to win, so just happy to win it. For me, it's the ultimate race, really, besides New Zealand Cup, because it's a great show of horsemanship, and, you know, my grandfather and father have won it, and, even a guy like Bob Negus who I taught, you know, learned a lot off when I was young. Just teach you little things that you learn along the way and hopefully they come for the first one down today was the day. Winning the dress today means a lot to me. Me and my young lady here, Jane, I think, you know, we're very happy. If Mary was here, you know what she would say, that we pray this course. So, one for Mary and we're very grateful that we win the race. Thank you very much. Going to the leaders, Restrepo. Coming out after it is For A Reason. Mac Beauty stays on and then came Bitter Bliss. It's Restrepo the leader. For A Reason's trying to wind up to go out after it. It's closing late. Restrepo still led. It's a neck in front. For A Reason dives will be too late and Restrepo. Restrepo beats For A Reason. Bitter Bliss might have been Mac Beauty in four. They've gone 154 and six and Restrepo into the Miracle Mile.